hi guys and welcome back to my youtube channel if you're new here hi hi i am langili here and i'm a 21 year old mom to a five months old boy and welcome to the family um i asked you guys to give me some few interesting topics for my youtube contents and y'all did so i just like to note everything down in this diary because it helps me to not forget whatever i want to say to you guys so the first topic is about how being mom changed me yeah how being how being a mother changed me this is so interesting so i just wrote a few points based on that so yeah man so um i just have a few things to do though today however i'm still gonna be doing this video in the meantime so stay tuned okay guys so here's the first one what i just picked up is that um so what has changed is that now is that now everything is not only about me it's about the baby so the baby comes first period um if i need to buy something like right now i will have to consider my son's needs before mine because i think that's just how it is supposed to be even in your relationship it is the baby that comes first so that's just strong about it you know so in addition to that i've also realized how much i actually need help like i'm the last person who'd ask for help and as a new mom i need help for my family my partner my friends like if i need to do something google um as in like um going back to school and study of which i'm now currently at my student residence i would need someone who's gonna watch baby for me so i know that i hate asking for help but now it's different i really need help so <laughs> that's just the whole thing um about this new mommy journey also mentioning that being a mother is hard alone um you become so emotionally vulnerable like honestly i remember this one time i was struggling with um my kettle was dirty i was struggling with breastfeeding my baby and i cried because it was so stressful there's a lot of things that stresses you with being a mom you stress a lot if you stress a lot if baby is not pooping you stress a lot if um baby is just sick generally yeah bon. so i think there's also so what i'm trying to say is that there's also more and more stresses to me and um so there's just like more and more stress that i have um, with regards to being with regards to being a young mother um, but however I'm just trying to like adjust into that um, I'm also like just always tired okay I barely rest my, my, my sleep clashes with the baby's sleep 
sometimes when the baby is sleeping i know they say that you have to sleep when baby sleeps i can't i have so many things to do i have to do is washing i have to wash my clothes as well i need to do assignments i need to do that so it's very hard to rest when the baby is also sleeping and you know i just got used to it i got used to it luckily i do not really have some bad 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 eye bags um but yeah i got used to it like guys you can't you won't believe me when i say that isolo i slept at 2 a.m but at 6 i was already up it's like my body just adjusted to being a mother so that's the another change that i can say to you guys so guys not all changes are bad like um ever since i became a mother i have been forced to actually plan up my life if i need to do something i know by a certain time i need to be done with it so that i can take care of the baby for instance for an instance during um the first month of my baby's birth um i had assignments so i was like okay ma can you just watch baby for me um i want to do an assignment and i knew it was okay i need to use time wisely do the assignment forget about instagram social media just do your work get done with it and then take your baby from your mom um so baby baby motivates me like i've learned how to be selfless i've learned how to love um i have more and more purpose into life and i'm very grateful for my baby like he came early yes but i'm so 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 grateful and at some point oh, being a mom i also have to take a break from doing things that i enjoy especially when there's no one around to help me with the child because i got a nanny when he was already three months old so um yeah man um if you have a lot of support you, you obviously can still do things that you enjoy um of which to me it was not the case so gr that's just another thing that i just picked out so another thing is my relationship with friends um you know i started to barely have time i started to uh barely have time for my friends because i'm just always just busy with the baby all the time and now my friends want to hang out they want to do that i mean I, ca I can't you know i can't i mean um I know I can always ask someone to help me out, but I know that I can always ask someone to watch the baby for me. But the problem is that myself, I'm not ready yet to go out there and be social and go out and, and have fun and have drinks. Just, just let me recover. Just let me get used to being a mother and let me just get over this postpartum anxiety um yeah so guys some changes were actually physical i mean are physical and that includes having bigger hair my afro honestly grew while i was pregnant which is a positive thing i'm so happy um my skin is fine and i gained so much of weight i'm gonna show you guys how my stomach looks i, I gained so much so i'm still gonna work on my body obviously um it's only been five months since i gave birth man so there's just no much rush that i have so yeah anyways i think i have now outlined everything that i saw as a change ever since i became a mother so i just want to say thank you so much guys for watching this video thank you so much for your support do not forget to leave a thumbs up and do not forget to leave a thumbs up. So now I'm going to be heading over to the airport.